you and all the boys look pretty disappointed after that game. It must be an absolute gutter. Absolutely, you know, it's yeah, it's frustrating. That's the word that'll sum it up. Is just absolute frustration. We felt we were the better team. Uh, we felt we had more chances. Uh, you know, it's just being that having that clinical uh, ruthless streak in front of goal that we just lacked today. Uh, it's it's disappointing because we've come a long way. Um, the fans have come a long way as well, and uh, we've gone home empty-handed and, and out of the cup, which we don't feel we deserve tonight. So it's it's gutting, absolutely gutting. But you know we've got to sort of take some silver lining and think we've got a game on Tuesday night now, which we can uh, we can bounce back from. Yeah. How quickly do you sort of stop thinking about this game and then sort of start looking to Geisley? Experience tells you that you need to move on quickly, but emotions don't let you tend tend to let you too, you know, move on too quickly. But um, I know that uh, part of my job, being the captain, is to rally the rally the lads, get them together, try and pick them up. We'll be in tomorrow morning. I would have thought. I'm not sure yet, but um, and try and lift their spirits. And because we've got to look at it take a step back and look at the grand scheme of things we're still second in the league we've got you know by, by points so we, we're still in a really good position this is frustrating because it could have been so good for the club for some of the young players you know to, to sort of put our name out there and get a little bit of financial uh, help um, so that is that is really frustrating and annoying but we've got to move on quickly and uh, and get ourselves going again for Tuesday. You've dominated this game, you've had the lion's share of the chances but just not been able to put them away. How can you, I suppose, not work smart, uh, work harder but work smarter? That's it, just being clinical and being ruthless and, um, you know, the, the the manager uses a term that, you know, someone's got your, your mum hostage, <laughs> you know, you've got to score to release her. So it's having that that kind of attitude that we need to score, we have to score to win games and, uh, you know, 90% of the time this season we've done that. There's not many many teams that shut us out. And if you look tonight, we probably should have scored. You know, there was one or two good saves, some really good defending from them, um, and a, just a few bit of uh, wastefulness from us. But you know, we, we don't want to get hung up on it. Um, we want to make sure we uh, we put this behind us as quickly as we can, um, and uh, hopefully we can score a barrel of goals on Tuesday night. And you're a seasoned old pro, but. Some of the younger lads sort of need to know how to be about a little bit more clinical, do they? It could be a reason why we found ourselves at this, you know, uh, um, at this level, you know, that, and that's myself included. I'm, I'm not ex excluding myself. It's, uh, you know, but we're trying to get out of this level and get um, get to a higher level, and that's something that they have to learn. We have to learn rather, um, and. I feel that we have been quite clinical this season. Um, we, we do create chances. We know we will create chances in games. Um, and maybe we could have scored a few more. But if you look at the, the stats in the league, we've been up there as one of the better scorers. So we can't get too disheartened about this. Um, it's, fr it's frustrating and you know will annoy us. But we, we've, we've got to move on um, and try and do that quickly because we're still in a great position in the league. Um, and unfortunately, um, we are out of the cup, so we have to try and concentrate on that now.